नमस्कार सदगुरु द पीरियड ऑफ यूथ इज डिफाइंड बाय चैलेंजेस गोल्स अचीवमेंट्स एंड एम्बिशंस मेनी चेज सक्सेस एज डिफाइंड बाय अदर्स इन दिस हाइपर कनेक्टेड इंफॉर्मेशन सैचुरेटेड एरा देयर इज द एडेड स्ट्रेस ऑफ इंफॉर्मेशन ओवरलोड एंड वर्क रिलेटेड बर्नआउट सच स्ट्रेस टेक्स अवे द हैप्पीनेस ऑफ आवर यंगस्टर्स वी सी मोर एंड मोर केसेस ऑफ डिप्रेशन अमंगस्ट यूथ हाउ कैन द यूथ इन सच चैलेंजिंग टाइम्स कंटिन्यूअली बी हैप्पी I want to know the truth about youth and happiness. Namaskaram Raj and uh, <laughs> See in every generation there is a set of people who are always complaining about something. And of course there are people who are making use of the situations of their times. As a generation today we have more conveniences, comforts and uh, we are able to know whatever we wish to know people who are complaining about information overload they must uh, visualize and see that a thousand years ago you wouldn't know what's happening 100 kilometers away if even there was a great calamity or something fantastic happened 100 kilometers away it would take a month or two months for you to get the information today anywhere in the world whatever is happening comes to you quickly and are you complaining about it <laughs> please do not complain about it because this is one of the greatest privileges that we have as a generation that technologically we are empowered like never before never before another humanity had the capabilities that we have simply because of technological empowerment it is just that you have not prepared yourself for the life that you need to handle in the sense right now you're complaining about technology which has made your life easy and comfortable <laughs> i want you to just imagine a thousand years ago if you lived here uh in the morning when you wake up you need water for your use you will have to walk down to the river and carry two buckets fulls of water believe me most of the youth today are not even fit enough to carry two buckets of water for a mile physically they're just not capable of doing it so if you were here a thousand years ago without technology would you carry these bucketfuls of water without complaint no you would complain because you are physically not capable similarly if you have not made yourself mentally capable of handling various realities of today then you complain so what the youth needs to understand is the early part of their life the most important thing is not your ambitions not your desires to be fulfilled not the lifestyles that you aspire for the only thing that you should be concerned about is how to enhance this life to a higher level of possibility if you do invest enough time in the inner development of who you are handling the present situations will be effortless and above all you will not be complaining about the greatest gifts that have been offered to you in this generation never before you could fly from india to united states in 14 hours time never before you could pick up your phone and talk to somebody in any part of the world never before you could see a million things happening all over the world and even in the outer space you can see what's happening please do not complain about these great gifts that you have you have to equip yourself equipping yourself means there are technologies for inner well being what we are transmitting as inner engineering is just this that you engineer yourself in such a way that you're fit for life instead of making yourself fit for life you're asking life around you to change for your level of unfitness please don't do this right now the world is not moving any faster than what it was a few thousand years ago the world is still spinning at the same time it is just that we feel that the distances have been reduced simply because of technological prowess that we have this is the most fantastic thing that's happened to human beings is we are so technologically empowered we can see beyond our normal vision you can hear beyond your normal sense of hearing you can experience things beyond your normal sense of experience it's just that you have to upgrade yourself the technology around you 
is phenomenally upgrading itself every few months or years, it's time you upgrade yourself. Upgradation of this technology, upgradation of who you are, enhancement of this life needs to happen. This is what in engineering or yoga means, that you focus on enhancing this life. Without enhancing this life, if you enhance your activity, of course you suffer the activity. It is like taking an old uh, <laughs> junky car on a F1 track, it'll fall apart. That's all that's happening to people. It's time that instead of just educating our children, just to make a living, just to find a job, just to get into this one or that one, we have to educate our children to first of all enhance themselves. Tools for self-transformation are the most important requirement of this age because external situations are going to be largely handled by machines. It's very important you are little smarter than the machines that you handle.